Hello dear all, I am Santosh Wa and welcome to channel Learn Easy Live by Sandhya Wa. This is the practice question number 11 for chapter comparing quantities class at mathematics. Question is given, a shopkeeper increases his stock of pens by 20% and then the stock is decreased by 20%. Find the net increase or decrease of stock in percentage. See here, what is given? Increase in stock and decrease in stock is only given. So I will write here, given is increase in stock increase in stock that is given 20 percent and decrease in stock decrease in stock only two things are given so here we will make a statement so let's assume the original stock original stock is not given but we have to assume so let's assume original stock, let's assume, let the original stock, original stock of pain is equal to 100, 100 numbers. That is for our convenience. Why 100? Because percentage is always on 100. 20 percentage means if original value is 100, then increase in stock is 20 numbers similarly when the original value when the original value is 100 decrease in is in numbers is also 20 so now we will calculate the increase or decrease in numbers so let's write here so here 20 percentage increase in numbers we can calculate in numbers that will be equal to 20 upon 100 into original stock is 100 this is for percentage 20 percentage and this is for our original value so we will get here 20 numbers isn't it that is the benefit why we have assumed the original stock as 100 because it is it becomes same in percentage also in numbers also so our new stock after increase in stock of 20 percent that will be equal to so i write here new stock new stock after increase in pain new stock equal to original stock is 100 and increase it 20 numbers so it, it becomes 120 numbers are you getting so new stock after 20 percent increase in pain becomes 120 numbers now this increased stock is decreased by 20 percent it is written then it is the stock is decreased by 20 percent so let's calculate the decrease numbers so so decrease stock number so decrease stock number in numbers that will be equal to decrease percentage is given 20 percent means 20 upon 100 and our stock is now 120 it is not now 100 it is it is 120 so multiplied by 120 we will get here this 0 0 so we will get 24 numbers 24 numbers so this is a decrease number when stock is 120 20 percent decrease means 24 numbers so new stock after decrease so new stock new stock after decrease in stock that will be equal to 120 minus 24 that will be equal to 96 numbers so this is our final stock and this is our original stock 100 numbers is original stock and this is 96 number is final stock now you you can observe there is a decrease in stock there is decrease in stock even though it is increased by 20% and decreased by 20% though the percentage are same but the base value is different base value for increase is 100 and base value for the decrease is 120 that's why in numbers in numbers increase numbers are 20 but decrease numbers are 24 so there is overall decrease so what is our original stock? Original stock is 100. This is original stock. 
isn't it this is original and this is final this is final so net there is decrease so let's calculate what is the decrease decrease is so net decrease so net decrease in stock is equal to original stock is 100 and final stock is 96 that is 0 4 numbers so this is the net decrease in numbers now what is us in percentage there is decrease we got the decrease but in numbers now we have to calculate in percentage so percentage decrease percentage decrease is equal to this is numbers 4 upon 100 and within for percentage we require multiplied by 100 so it it, it is again 4 percentage so percentage decrease is 4 percent are you getting though there is same numbers for increase and decrease in percentage but the base value for increase is 100 numbers and for decrease it is 120 numbers that's why in numbers decrease is more 24 numbers that four numbers are more that is four percent decrease is final that is a percentage decrease net percentage decrease of stock is four percent this is all for this video we will meet again in our next video do learn do enjoy thank you